Nation on WPFW 89.3. I am your host, Julian Agro, and tonight's show is our 2K Nation Monthly Cypher. Our guests tonight are, first of all, we have Eric Powell, a.k.a. ELPJ. Peace, what's up? We have my man Jakari. How y'all doing out there? And we got my man Z. Hello, everybody. Yes, and we are going to go to a quick music break. And when we come back, you will have our monthly cipher. Awesome. Try not to say. Okay, we are back. Good evening, and welcome to 2K Nation again. You are back. You are listening to our monthly cipher. If you are just tuning in right now, we have my panel, my guests. First off, we have Z. Hello. We have Jakari. How y'all doing out and there? We have my man, spoken word, lyricist, Eric Powell, a.k.a. ELPJ. What up, what up? So, first off, I just want to ask you guys a few questions before we get into it. I just want to ask, like, where are you guys from and uh, what do you do? Um, well, I'm from PG County. I'm from Maryland. Right. Um, and I spit. I, I rhyme. I'm an MC. And I do poetry, spoken word. So. All right, that's what's up. My name is Jahari Mercer. I'm from Southeast DC, east of the river, um, around Anacostia. I play E flat, alto saxophone. I play for my church. I learned how to play through my school. And so now I play for my church every fourth Sunday. Um, I got a whole big book of music. So anybody got any requests, any Christian requests, let me know. I'll see if I got it in my book. Um, but yeah, I just love performing. I love doing what I do. All right, cool. And Z? Um, yeah, I'm from PG, but most of the time, most of my life, I've been living in DC and I play a little bit of guitar. I write lyrics and I do spoken word. Oh, uh, nice. Yeah, because me personally, I'm from uh, inside DC, so Mount Pleasant. Uh, I produce beats, I make beats, and I, uh, I rap too. And I play the drums, actually. That's my main instruments. That's what I started off doing. So, um, yeah. And uh, I just want to let you, I just want to ask you guys, how'd you guys get started in the music? Um, well, I've kind of, I mean, I, I started with hip hop. I've, I've always been, it's like, it's in my blood. I, I was born loving hip hop from the very beginning of my life. And I, I got into rhyming when I was like around nine to 10. I, like, I came home from school one day because I was sick. We was in music class and we was sitting, we was singing the Star Spangled Banner. It was like back in like fifth grade. And so I was just laying down looking at the clock, trying to feel better and all that. While I was just thinking about that song, Land of the Free, Home of the Brave. I was like, yo, that's not right. Native Americans was being discriminated against, blacks were slaves, you know, and I was just, that, that was kind of the beginning of me digging into the lies and trying to tell the truth through my music. And I got into spoken word a little bit later, so. Yeah, that's what's up. Jakari, how about you? Uh, me, I got into music. I started playing with my school. Um, so my school, it's a Christian school. So if I know how Christian school, I started playing with my school. I'm a church boy, so everybody knows it, but I like being a church boy. But um, I started playing with my school and my music teacher told me how to play, told me how to play the basics. And then I went to like more complicated stuff, actually playing music and different things like that. And um, I got my start. And so I played with my school. We had like different concerts, orchestra concerts, stuff like that. And so that's what I would do then. And after that, when I was no longer in orchestra, I wanted to just keep playing. And so after that, I started to play with um, the Youth and Young Adult Choir in my church every fourth Sunday. And so some of the songs we play, I have in my book. Some songs I have to get music for, I have to talk to some people to get music for, or make music for. So that's how I got my start. And uh, like I said, I just love entertaining and love performing. It's just so much fun to be on stage. Yeah, definitely, definitely. I know, I know what you mean. And uh, next up, we got Z. Um, well, ever since I was little, music has always been a part of my life. It's been like a major part of my life. And then in the fifth grade, I got into rock and roll. But before that, when I was about, I don't know, like eight, or seven, I got, my mom bought me an acoustic guitar for Christmas, so I started to teach myself how to play it a little bit, and then I just, like, stopped, probably because, you know, some of my strings had popped, and then I, like, like, 
two, three Christmases ago, I got an electric guitar, and ever since then, I've been, like, trying to play it. I'm not, like, I'm okay at it, but I'm not, like, no slash or anything, so. Yeah, yeah, I know what you mean. Um, we are going to go to a quick music break, and after the break, we'll be back with our cypher.